many doctors suffer from depression. As doctors are more knowledgeable about medicine than the general population, one would assume that they are the best at taking care of their own health. Studies say it is the other way. Many of them suffer from physician depression. Many doctors admit they had depressive symptoms as a resident in turn during their training years. They were unable to feel joy, they cried frequently, had trouble connecting with patients, and were experiencing feelings of anxiety. Depressed doctors are not only a danger to themselves, but they can be harmful to their patients in extreme cases. According to one study published last year, one in four young doctors experience depression. Physicians exist in a profession where admitting a problem carries with it a stigma that's more impactful than others. Because of the stigma, many of physicians turn to substance abuse, alcoholism and drug abuse to self-medicate as opposed to mental health treatment. In a 2012 study researchers found 15% of the American College of Surgeons had some level of alcoholic abuse or dependence. The number was even higher among female surgeons, up to 25%. The researchers also found that depression was the strongest link to substance abuse among doctors. Doctors have much easier access to drugs than others. Because of this, they are more likely to misuse prescription drugs than the general population. Hand in hand with depression is physician burnout. Another significant issue rampant in the healthcare world, affecting young residents, nurses, and even experienced surgeons. Physicians have one of the highest suicide rates among any profession. Too many physicians, especially trainees, suffer in silence, afraid to ask for help for fear that they will be punished professionally, if not personally. Raising awareness about the issue would allow doctors to begin removing the stigma of mental health treatment. Thank you.